good day viewers you are welcome to my channel you are welcome to do my solution tank you are welcome to a home where nothing absolute nothing is impossible before god almighty today is another day that the lord has made we will rejoice and be glad indeed i want to teach you how to make fire how to return back the fire that the enemy kindled for us. Many graves has been opened to swallow a lot of people because I see the cloud of change of head. This is the middle of the year, month of June. Yes, as you are seeing this month, it looks as if you would think, say from January to now, I have not achieved anything, but I want you to think wider. Remember that you are alive. It is when you are alive, the dead cannot praise the Lord. It is when you are alive, you think of next action to take. Here is the next action. How to return those that dig the grave. How to return them back into their grave. If somebody wants you dead, his action is different. The way he operates is different. You can't overlook their operation. Indeed, let me just brief you. There is a lady called Halima. Halima Hassan. Yes. H square. I normally call her H square. She, she, she personally came to me that she always dreamed of traveling and she, that journey she never come back. I said to her, the journey you are going is the journey of death. If you see yourself entering into a car and you move on a journey that you never return, it's called the journey of death. So this is what I told her to do. And that is what I'm going to tell you now. I guess what? Her uncle, who so much showed her love, is the one that wanted to kill her. He's the one that desired to kill her. But as God leave it, for how God revealed it to me, yes. Immediately she talked to me. I said, give me time. Let me pray. When I pray, I saw this man holding a cutting board in his hand. This is what we call cutting board. Mm? Cutting wood. That might be. Yes. This is what we call cutting wood. You think. This is how it looks like. Yeah. You can just cut a little out of it like this. Then this man uh, bought a baby and he wrote her name on the body of that toy. And he called the toy Halima. And I took the, this thing like this into the room of that toy. Like this. You see, this is exactly what he did. Yes. And I'm going to teach you now what you would do. That is what I talked to her. I said, Come, my dear Halima. Already this man have declared you dead. And you're already right. Is lying down in the mortuary. I want you, if you know clearly that your battle is is of not the, the, our battle is not of the world, it's of the spirit. So we walk in the spirit, and the spirituality speak to the reality, speak to the body, to the life, and to the physical. So for that reason, we are going into the spirit to take the fight. To the spirit realm, and before you get to the spirit realm, you have to behave like a dead body. Get your cutting wool, put into your nose. You are going to pray. Don't mind me, eh? Put it the way that you can breathe. You understand? Or the second nose now. You see, then you pick up your two candle. This is back to center. And this one is life. 
you are returning what life if you don't see this color please make use of white if you don't find this color please make use of make use of uh, red or black any of the color you find you can use but basically this is what i need to carry out this spiritual item <laughs> Then you now say it to yourself, he said, anyone that I have put cutting wood into my use to kill me, as I'm burning this two candle, before it burn or finish, I want them dead. And any cutting wood I put into my nose, after I finish the prayer, you now remove it, you say, I remove it. Life go into my body. Life go into my body. Life go into my, enter into my business. Enter into my 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 work, my ministry. Let there be life. In everything I'm doing, let there be life. Then do not remove the cotton from your nose. But set fire on this. Before you set fire, make sure there is that cotton into your nose before you set the fire. After the fire, then remove it and declare life into your life. Please, my dear viewers, carry out this assignment and you shall hear obituary of those that want you dead. If you have a practical enemy, please make sure her name. But if you don't have practical enemy, you don't know your enemy, maybe you are predicting uh, this person, this person, don't call anybody's name so that you not pray and miss. Yes. The any hand that dig a hole shall eat whatever they find in the hole. Anyone that wants you dead shall die in your place. Whoever dig grave for you shall enter into thy grave. That grave will not accept chicken. That grave will not accept uh, lizard. It is the hand that dig the grave that will get into it in the name of Jesus Christ. I covered you before you carry out this assignment, please. In case this, this is a dangerous assignment, and it must not be carried out in the daytime. It's very, very dangerous. I can't tell you like it has to be carried out in the night because somebody must die. Somebody will die, and somebody must die in our position. Whoever wants us dead will go for our sake, and whoever needs you. That won't want you to stay alive will not be alive. We are we are not looking for trouble. We are only trying to escape the grave that the enemy has dig for us. You, as you carry out this assignment, as you work to for that, my daughter Halima, Halima Hassan, it will work for you in the name of Jesus Christ. My 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 job here it doesn't specify this religion or that religion. And everybody has problem. As long as you have problem, solution is sure. Except you refuse to discuss your problem out, you want to die alone, and definitely you will die alone, and you'll be buried alone. Even your children cannot enter the grave with you. See, you have to make use of what? Alligator pepper. Pick one seed. Can you see it here? Pick one seed of alligator part of it, and use it to trust yourself. In case there is any way I've sinned against God, I've sinned against mankind, I trust myself. Any, any palace, any kingdom I've entered that they use, they put me in, that do not allow my prayer to be effective, I trust myself, I trust myself. Do not throw it away. That is the first assignment before you carry out the remaining job. Please, endeavor as you are passing by, subscribe to this channel. I love you. Jesus loves you more than I do. Your thumbs up is very important and very necessary. Jesus loves you. Remain blessed until we meet again.